Welcome to Drinking Bros, presented by GhostBed.com. One, two, three. Welcome to Drinking Bros. D'Anthony, we have a woman of the cloth. Are you, you're a nun, right? Nope. <laughs> nope, not at all. Uh, what's the opposite of that? Um, Whore. <laughs> Yeah. I, I look at least you said it, not us, because <laughs> typically it's us who who say that. But it's That's usually okay. calling me calling Dan a whore. Yeah, I don't slut shame because uh, I love sluts. So yeah, wow. big fan. We yeah. we get Katie Cush in the house. Hello, everybody. Katie, you're you're famous for pornography. I am. Um, and I don't microf- know. I don't know about famous, but like I do the pornography. <laughs> you're pretty fucking famous. Thank you. I mean, I I would say. You're one of those people, because look, this is on video on YouTube, obviously. You're, you're one of those people who, when they see this show, they'll be like, oh, man, I jacked off to that girl. Ah, oh, on her face. Yeah, Well, not on her face. No, you, you print it. out. So I've got this old dot matrix printer. <laughs> yeah. Like the ones you see at AutoZone and shit. It prints out. <laughs> it makes like, the noises and everything. Yeah. <laughs> and it's like a black and white. I like ASCII photo, and then I just pound off onto it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, then, and then you... Then I mail it to her. It's, <laughs> so, <laughs> so if you Best receive some weird mail, mail I'm sorry ever. about okay. uh, <laughs> Could you imagine? No. Uh. Actually, honestly, I shouldn't say no because there's It'll some interesting people out there. Yeah, Wait, didn't somebody do that to Jared? <laughs> Matt Piva took that picture of him passed out on the front steps of the of Black Rifle. Yeah. And then put it on the internet and told people to... Or you put it on the internet and told people to fucking... <laughs> Photoshop come onto it and it looked like some dude actually came on it and then uploaded a picture. So we had a we had a contest. Uh, our, one of our other co-hosts who's not here because he got blackout last night, blackout <laughs> drunk. He Reasons said I didn't go out. <laughs> he hate, he hates come. Uh huh. Hates it. I used to too. <laughs> oh really? So anyways, we had I, on the show. We said, look, everybody, print out a photo of Jared's picture mm-hmm. and then just jack off all over it and then just keep sending it to, to him, him online. Yeah, because <laughs> it's not illegal to put on Facebook. No. Because it's just cum, right? So there was hundreds of pictures of dudes blasting loads all over our, our co host face. Oh, yeah. He, he, he'll, he's he one of those throw like up throw up at the sight of yeah. cum. No way. Yeah. yeah. Just a picture of seeing cum. Oh, yeah. His own, too. He doesn't like his own cum. So. How does that work? Uh, I, don't know. I, save, I save mine. <laughs> what do you do? Yeah. What saving. do you save yours for? You freeze it? Gardening. I mean, no. It's. <laughs> You should see his freeze garden. It. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, you should you see his it? garden. It's grow really tomatoes nice. Tomatoes and, and, and mint. Yep. Is that the like that. cure? Is that how you have a green thumb? Um, no, but it makes them a lot bigger. I'm afraid I've gotten some plants <laughs> pregnant over here. So it makes I may have uh, to pay some child support at some point. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> he's, he definitely is. Uh, oh, and someone a baby paycheck. You know what I'm saying? No. <laughs> what, what day is this in Vegas for you right now? What, what? What day is this in Vegas for you right now? Um, I don't know what day is it. It's a Wednesday. It's Wednesday. No, one, no, out, for you. one out of how oh. many or two out of how many? Yeah, yeah. What does that mean? Oh I my was, god! How long have you I been here? I've lived here for four months. Oh okay, shit! So you know, I'm like, I don't understand what you mean. I live no, here. No, we thought you were in town for this bullshit. <laughs> no, uh, I live here, so you know, okay. I didn't have to pay to be here. I just uh, drove 20 minutes. Yeah, what? it's the AVNs. Look, yeah. I'm, I'm, I don't so know. So now we all know where you live. So those dot matrix. You don't know where I live. You oh. just know I live here. I don't know where you live, but it's I know a small this. Town. This is my sixth day in Vegas, and this is exactly how I feel. My skin <laughs> is like Steve Bannon's. I feel like uh, that's the appropriate <laughs> feeling for the sixth day. I'm peeling. I don't know what's <laughs> going on with my hair. Uh, the Magnum, I feel like that should be the third day. The Magnum PI mustache is here. Oh, yeah. And uh, this thing's going to live for a little bit. So I might as well just let it breathe oh, today. Yeah. 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 Um, let me ask you about getting into porn. Okay. When you first started, right? And you had we don't do videos, segues here, by the way. Okay. At all. That's fine. So at you all. could get fucked if you were expecting if that. You were <laughs> that could you at home. Nope. We're jumping right into the skin boat here. All right. Let's <laughs> dive in. We're, ju- we're, we're right into the skin boat. Okay. When you got into porn, yes. how did you tell your parents? Um, well, I told my mom first because I am, my mom has no room to judge. So I was like, I don't really care if she cares or not. Mm-hmm. So once I decided to get into it within the first week, I texted her and I said, hey, just so you know, I'm doing porn. She, I started off as a cam girl. So mm-hmm. I was just doing the online stuff. Um, so she knew I was doing that already. She actually used to do that when she was my age. So I was like, hey, just so you know, I'm taking a step further. I'm going to get into porn. And she was like, OK, you're an adult. Do what you want to do. So she knew first, didn't care. My sister knew second, didn't care. And then actually just this Christmas, I brought it up to my father. Yeah. And the way I brought it up to him was, 
is there anything I could do in this life that would make you not talk to me anymore? Yeah. And he was like, why do you ask that? And I was like, I'm just wondering. And then he gave me some stupid reason. And I was like, it has nothing to do with that shit. It's like career wise. If there's anything I would do as a career, would you stop talking to me? And he gave me this weird ass side look. And he was like, considering what I know you do now, I don't think so. And I was like, I knew you knew. So he knew already that I was doing porn. He did? Because yeah. he watches it. I mean, look. He does. You, you, He's you'll, straight. Run, you'll run into it. Look. That's, that he knew. He plays hockey. And he even asked me. He was like, can you tell me? He's like, this might be weird, but can you tell me what sites you are on just so I know not to get on yeah. them? Oof. Yeah. <laughs> you're, you're everywhere, though. I know. He was like, so who? He was like, who? Who's the production for Per City? And I was like, ooh, tread lightly. Yeah. I was like, I am on there. So imagine, tread lightly. Imagine jacking off to your on your daughter like on accident. It's old boy. But let's say, let's say like you were doing a doggy scene, right? <laughs> and he can't see your face. Right. And he's just like, man, I've got to pop one off before this <laughs> hockey match. And then all of a sudden, right as he comes, <laughs> there's my face. It, you turn around, and he's like, "It's too late to stop." And he's like, "Oh no!" <laughs> Slow motion right. rope. Just know you're not alone. <laughs> I'm gonna make this place your home. It's like a fucking <laughs> instrumental, like the end of American Idol song playing, and there's your daughter. Yeah. Holy shit! What Did a wonderful, imagine? what a wonderful thing to get your father for Christmas. Yeah. Yeah. It was a great Christmas story, yeah. actually. It is. You should you should remake. Merry Christmas, Dad. Yeah. I'm a porn star. Wow. How old I, are you, by the way? I'm twenty two years yeah, you're old. You're young as fuck, dude. Sure. Yeah. What's what year did you start? I started a year and a half or a year and a month ago, sorry. Okay. Yeah, so I'm new. Ooh. Ish. Ish. <laughs> I heard you just shot for Brazzers. I did. That's was, a big deal. It is a big deal. I did my first boy boy girl with Brazzers last weekend. Okay, so why boy, boy, girl? Because they told me to. No, no, no. <laughs> but why do, why do they go in that order? I would have said girl, boy, boy, maybe. You know? Um, I don't it think, sounds better, boy, boy, girl. Yeah, I don't think the order that the names are in have anything to do with Nothing what happens. Nothing at all. Mm-hmm. It doesn't? No. Like who no. starts first? No. It's not like, uh, like a coin toss first. before a football game? You do. <laughs> I always start first. Because it starts with a hard beat, right? Yeah. Um, no, it starts with a hard intro. <laughs> oh, really? Of <laughs> Dialogue. <laughs> Oh, you, is it, yeah. it's scripted. It's most of it, yes. What, was it? Uh, I can see where you're coming from, though, with the boy, boy. Like, you, is it the first scene? It's the two guys, and they're just watching football, and all of a sudden they start, <laughs> Correct. Then they start wrestling, yep. and shit gets out of hand, and then the girl comes in like, what the fuck are you guys doing? Correct, yeah. What are you doing? I, Get I out of each other's asses. I made you Hot Pockets. Yeah. yeah. All right, I guess I'll blow you both before the, the Hot Pockets, you know, Get cool cooled, off. Yeah. 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 Not uh-huh. ever how it ever goes. No, no. Do you remember any, more, any of your are dialogue? You, saying you, you don't need. Do I remember the dialogue? Yeah, mm-hmm. I remember the whole scene. It's funny you brought up football because it was a football scene. <laughs> there it is. I probably saw it. <laughs> <laughs> no, it hasn't come out yet. It's still being edited. Do you know? Let, let's hear the dialogue. Do you remember any of it? I don't know if I can disclose this information. I'm just kidding. Um, yeah. Uh, what was the dialogue? <laughs> like, what was your opening line when you saw the dudes? Do you remember um, that? Well, it, it wasn't a traditional boy, boy, girl. I was a hoe. And basically, I slept with my boyfriend and his dad within the same day. Fuck. I'm really glad that this was your first here. So <laughs> you, you, you've got to answer this for me. Long time. Obviously, not first time fan of porn. Watched a lot of <laughs> pornography in my lifetime. Mostly for just trying to understand women. Science purposes, right? Yeah, not mm-hmm. for myself, not for pleasuring my own body. Sure. Just to try to understand women a little better. Here's what I can understand. Everything in porn, I would say towards the last two years, is really going heavy incest. So it's like, fuck the stepmom, fuck the daughter, fuck the stepdaughter. It's what's in. It, why? Because that's what the fans want. Really? So Dan and I have a theory on this, right? Um, with Russia. I know this sounds crazy, so buckle up here. I'm not too smart, so like... Totally fine. <laughs> don't get too this, crazy, this but okay, I'm not going to be that deep, I can promise you that. We're, we're am, discussing porn. I'm listening. Can I'm you listening. imagine like... <laughs> not Socrates. Like, you know? hey, I want to tell you uh, about this <laughs> this uh, recent experiment. Like, no, just don't talk to me about science or math. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, okay. I'm listening. Absolutely I'm listening. not. I'm sorry. So, I, I have a theory that like Russia and other governments mm-hmm. are specifically gearing not not just media because you know that kind of happened in the last election um with facebook but gearing different forms of media to change americans to have a different mindset you think russians are behind that so i think the algorithm for incest and shit like that 
is slowly to change our mentality over here. Because I'll be, I'll be reals with you here. I can speak for the three of us in this room. None of us ever, well, maybe not Dan, but never dreamed of fucking the mom, fucking the sister. Like my actual mom? Yes. No, of course not. Yeah. But if what my, about a step? If my dad had married, and just for the record, my dad is a piece of shit. We've established yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But even if he wasn't, and he got divorced in the mirror, the super hot chick. I'm gonna try to bang her for sure. That's fuck. Why would I not do that? Right, right, right. You know but I mean? specifically, you know, your parents, because uh, all of it's geared towards that. And you're like, man, I, if I could just not see that keyword. Yeah. Because sometimes that's the turnoff, right? Where it's just like, I don't want to see somebody. Let's fucking let's a dad. get into this. Let's. I'm 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 irritated now. <laughs> why? why uh, explain to me why it is socially unacceptable to fuck people that are related to you honestly <laughs> i'm not very I'm not much a, against the law i'm not an God. advocate no but that's a law that we made like intrinsically and why? isn't it scientific that if you sleep with someone that you're related to that like it'll create yeah the gene yeah, the yeah, gene. yeah 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 the create what uh, like, like a, deformities. A, a deformities retards yes correct hey hey retards deformities yeah deformities <laughs> well yeah Retarded. Cl- close I'm eyes. Sorry. <laughs> we'll go. We'll go close eyes. Okay. We'll okay. go close eyes. Right. <laughs> or a fish what? eye. Yeah. 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 No, close what eyes. What did you just say? The, fi- <laughs> the fish eyes. The ones that are further apart. That's, walleye. Yeah. That's fetal alcohol mm. syndrome. By the yeah, way. Yeah. There was a girl on the hills who had a walleye. Uh, Adriana. Partridge, was it one that was real just sneaking hot. away, or was it both of them? No, it was going up. <laughs> so it was always. They used to call her uh, ceiling eyes. Because <laughs> she was always standing ceiling the eyes. So hot though. Um, <laughs> Uh, Anyways, yeah. yes, that is true. Over time, there could be deformities, particularly when women are over 35. But that's the case that. with women over 35 in general. Have you looked up for that for a reason? Like, or looked into that? I, I just know mm-hmm. stuff. You'll, <laughs> yeah. It's, I'm, I'm, you'll you just find know out different things. That he just knows stuff. Okay. Yeah. You know? <laughs> At any rate, uh, tell me why. Forget about the law okay. and society. Tell me why society, from day one, decided, well, you can't fuck your aunt or your cousin. Why would you do that? Yeah. So tell me why, because for a, I guess it wasn't like that for a long time. People did it. Yeah. I mean, isn't that how Europe. we all became who we are? And everyone was just fucking their siblings, right? I guess so. But so they say. So you why? I guess there was like at some point people were like, "Hey, we're making a lot of retards over here. We got to calm." <laughs> yes. Down. Have you ever but, been to West Virginia? <laughs> oh yeah, bro. It's rough, dude. I mean, it's. I mean, it's, it's like rough. People are walking around just dragging their arms behind them. Yeah, and, shit. and like hollers and shit, where you're just like, dude. Where? Am I? <laughs> uh, welcome to Drinking Bros. I want to welcome you back. Um, we, we've learned about. I honestly can't answer that question for you. I, really I know no one can. I've never heard anyone give me a solid answer other than. It's just the laws. Other, other than society made it taboo because there was a negative outcome sometimes. Right. Right. I but that's fucking stupid. Scientific. Have you ever, just get a vasectomy and then bang your mom, dude. It's not like. Oh, God. No. Would you? Fuck no. Okay, <laughs> so can you answer me why you would not? Why is that uh, unacceptable towards not, you? She's not hot. I mean, it's just, it is what it what is. What if your mom was hot? Then yeah, fuck yeah. No, I'm just kidding. What if we're <laughs> shit? I, it's not the mo- it's not the like moms and sisters and shit like that. But uh, for, why is it a first cousin? Like that person's not. I don't know them. They are related to you though, because sort of, it's your so mom's else. brother's child or your mom's sister's child. Yeah, they, but have a, has a family member ever tried to bone you? Yeah. Uh, what what's cousin yeah. brother? Cousin. Okay. What, what, uh, where did you uh, grow we up? never really grew up together, though. They grew up in Michigan, and I grew up in Arizona. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Did it happen? I can't. I don't know. I was like, we shared a room, and I was like sleeping, and in my head, I thought something happened. But you know how sometimes, like, it's you think it's a dream. Sure, sure. You know what I mean? But he um, kind of disclosed some information to me that kind of made it sound true. Through emails, so I'm like, mm, I don't know if it happened. It could Oof, happen. I wouldn't. I would have faxed that in. I definitely uh, wouldn't email. Should that. I just Here, ask him? Yeah. Here's what I do. I I, I print it on a dot matrix printer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then jack off to it, and then, and send, then send it, send it, it to, to you. you. Yeah. Say, just hey. my list. I yeah. got cousin. I got stepdad. Who else can we add to that <laughs> list? Yeah. Uh, no, but that's that's the way fucking porn bounces. And uh, you know, look, my wife's not in the room, so I can tell you this. Like, I've jacked off to one of my porns, wife's You know what I'm saying? So uh, she's not. Yeah. 
Um, Me? Yeah, we were scrolling through your Pornhub earlier, and I was like, ah, oh, fuck. And we both just sat here and Which started one? jacking yeah. off. I mean, together? Well, well, not together. What do you mean by together? Oh. Like, we were no. like did you come room. together? I'll show no, you No, it was one. different times, and we were at least three feet apart. Yeah, least. because that's that's our rule. Yeah. That's our personal <laughs> we rule. We put a yardstick As long as we're us. three feet apart, so, I, it was we cr- may it, masturbate together. It was yeah. crazy stepsister fucks brother, and like, but it's the thumbnail. Oh, yeah, What's that was a good one. Yeah. But it's the thumbnail, Ninja, so yeah. it's just like, and it's the, look, it's, if you're at home, uh, dial this up on Pornhub, crazy stepsister fucks brother, Katie Cush, uh, it's 1409 is the time code, but this thumbnail was so money that I was like, oh, fuck, god damn it, man, and this has got like 400,000 views. Yeah. Yeah. So, well, as soon as I was like, oh, all right, cool, we try to do our research, obviously, around here. <laughs> I didn't know that I had already researched you at some point in my life, but I, I have. came to you. Yeah. <laughs> Um, and now you're here. That's awesome. Yeah, but uh, like, you're. How many do you think you've done here? Because there's a lot. How many scenes have I done mm-hmm. since I've started? Yes, definitely over a hundred. Okay. I don't know the exact number, but I tried to count. And from last year, I started around. My very first film was in August, but I didn't become a full-on porn star and decide to get into it until around November-ish. Okay. Um. So since November of 2018 till now. I've probably done over a hundred scenes for sure. Okay, so it's gonna, about two a week. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll, I'll bring up some uh, uh, of our faves here, and then you tell us if you remember any of this. I remember pretty much everything I have done. I think, okay. and every person I have done as well. Blonde glory hole cocksucker eats so much cum. Do you yep. remember that one? Yes, I do. Somebody couldn't get hard because I was making love to the dick. It pissed me off. <laughs> All right, so the first person that came into my glory hole uh-huh. um, and how I suck dick. I don't know. Apparently, I make love to the dick. I've never heard that before. I don't fucking know. Yeah. Um, but they had to stop it because he couldn't come. And they were like, hey, just so you know, you're not here to make love to the dick. Just fuck it with your face. And so I was like, okay. And I went hard. And he still couldn't come. So I was like, get the fuck. He, they kicked him out. Really? Actually, they, they kicked him out. Yeah, because he, he couldn't do his job. Um, but after that, yeah, every single person came. So if he, if, if they can't come, they're just like, yo, get the fuck out of here. Like yeah. this, this job isn't for you. Yeah. Hombre. Mm-hmm. Um, all uh-huh. anal, <laughs> all anal, juicy anal affair with Bella Jane. Okay. I was like, Katie I've never Kush. done anal. So no, but yeah, that was ass to mouth, which means they stick it in her ass and then stick it in my mouth. How, how is that? What's the, what's the taste of, of, of something like that? Mm-hmm. It's kind of like licking a battery. I would imagine, right? So yummy. Is it really? No, it's not. Yeah. It? <laughs> no one likes that mm. shit, right? Um, if you're into it, <laughs> I guess. Uh, Katie Cush lets him feel how tight her pussy is. Do you remember that one? I don't remember you're that. Name. These are on a couch. Clips, like they get cut. Oh, and new retitled. sensations. Yes, I remember yeah. that one. Yeah, like they, they change on Pornhub. They change the titles for yeah. sh- for some of them, especially if it's a big company like New Sensations. Mm-hmm. They'll change the title around. Yeah, it's probably stolen, and that's why. So Pog 69's with her boyfriend on the couch for True Amateur. Do you remember that one? True Amateur, yes, I do. That was with Zach Wilde. What's P- explain what Pog is? Fat Pog ass, is fat ass white girl. Oh, they're going PH on fat, huh? Look at that. Apparently, at that. you learn something new it's every day. Very nineties, isn't it? <laughs> Uh, I didn't even know that. So, porn fidelity. Bubble butt Katie Cush displays her assets. Yes, yeah. I remember that one. That was all about my flexibility. Uh, swallowed cock sucking uh-huh. trio. Katie Cush, Chanel Shortcake, and Fariana Bardo. Yeah, yes. Jesus Christ! I told you. I remember almost. <laughs> I'm pretty new, so I remember almost every. But single you've done a hundred scenes. Yeah, that's amazing. Um, who is your favorite to work with so far? That's a really hard question because there are really good people out there. Um, so it's kind of a handful. And I also still haven't worked with people that I really want to work with. So they would probably top those people. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. Anybody that wanted to date you afterwards where they were like, look, the sex was crazy. <laughs> we should give this a shot in real life. Luckily, no, because I'm not about it. Really? I'm not about the dating life. Because it's, it's, it's pretty prevalent in the porn star world. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of porn stars date or marry each other, right? Very quickly. They dive in those relationships. Yeah, we had another one on the show. Uh, what was Homegirl's name? Do you remember? We did it at uh, Nine Fine Irishmen. Yes, Jacqueline Taylor. And her boyfriend was in porn. Or fiance, that's right. Wow. 
Um, no, no longer big again. shock that they're no longer together because they dive in. <laughs> we asked what well, we asked her. We were like, what's the what's the story when you get home? And she's like, dude, I just I finished fucking all day. I don't want to come home and fuck him and vice versa. Like he doesn't want to come home and fuck me. And I was like, why are you together? And they were like, well, somebody to watch Netflix with. It's a friend. Yeah. 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 I'd rather have friends without having to deal with the bullshit. So who do you date in real life? Myself. <laughs> That's it. You know, I really boyfriend. do not fuck with boyfriends. I actually got into this industry after a three and a half year long relationship. So been there, done that. I'm just really not about it right now. I feel like I'm more about like finding myself and doing my own thing and making my own own, you know, industry type stuff. So yeah. I just really don't want to deal with it. What has has he ever watched any of your porn? I don't know. We don't really we don't talk. It did not end well. Oh, it didn't. No. But did he ever message you and be like, "Yo, what the fuck? I saw this." No, nope. no shit. Yeah. What happened? Um, I decided to break up with him after we were really deep in our relationship. Like, owned a house, three dogs, everything. But I decided to break up with him because he started getting very mentally psychotic. Mm-hmm. Thought I was cheating on him all the time. He couldn't trust me. Oh, every time you go out, you're you're sucking other people's dicks, blah, blah, blah. So the more he just kept nagging about how I was cheating on him and not paying attention to him, I was like, well, now you make me want to go do it. So, yeah. and I was really close to his sister. And right before I got in the industry, one of the last things I said to her was, I don't know if that's the last dick I ever want to fuck. So <laughs> then I decided to break up with him. It got really fucking bad from there until we... He left California and I sold the house. And you should then have I got in the sister corn. or something. Oh, that would have been the, the best. Dude, yeah. right? Yes. But I don't. Isn't she's funny? Way, they're way Mexican, way too family oriented. Mm. Way ah, too family oriented. I see. Yeah. yeah. I, bet, I bet there was. That's a, unfortunate that you weren't able to ruin his family. <laughs> yeah. The <laughs> over under for an, a Mexican family is about 18, right? Uh-huh. There's usually 18 of them. Yeah. There's a fucking lot of them. That's what I'm saying, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I'm sure I could find one of them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to fuck, you know? fuck his dad, dude. <laughs> his That's dad what I do. If somebody off. pisses me off, like you can fuck somebody's wife or girlfriend and that would suck. But if I fuck their dad, there's no coming back from that. No, that's true. Like that's, if, that's it's game over for that motherfucker. Yeah, if 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 a dude fucks their dad, like hey, yeah. that's it. Like and I take a Polaroid and anytime homeboy starts talking shit, I just pull it out and show it to him. Yeah. Like and I, it's like, hey, I fucked your dad, Damn. man. Yeah, you guys right. his straight dad, <laughs> I not a gay that. dad. No, his straight dad. Gay. It's got to be a straight you dad. <laughs> you understand? I feel you 100. percent Yeah, okay, good. I'm glad because I was getting kind of angry that you weren't picking up what I was no, putting I'm, down there. I'm but now we're up. clear, right? We're clear. It's a straight father. Yes. Okay. Great. <laughs> yes. Has never even thought about being gay his entire life. No, but not, he's no. Uh, he can't think of anything else now. <laughs> 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 Uh, Katie, we got some sponsors, uh, which is crazy enough that we uh, <laughs> that pay for this fucking show to be on the air. Speaking of incest, <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to have incest, if you're going to fuck your scared sister on a bed, might as well be a ghost bed from ghostbed.com forward slash drinking bros. Look, I I know we shouldn't be saying this, but uh, I, they left the promo code up. It's flash 25 and you can yeah. still get 25 off everything in the full. Fucking you know, store. look, man. Sorry, I'm sorry. It I'm is not what it sorry is. about it. Yeah. it is what it What's is. a ghost bed? It's, it's a bed. Best mattress on the planet. So it 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 comes in a box right to your house. Uh, they get ghost pillows. It is the most comfortable fucking mattress. You just got one, dude. Uh, Xander just got one off off camera. Is it really? Yes, it's the best. Um, we had. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Um, and it's uh, it's one of those mattresses where you're like, all right, I'm home. Like I'm 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 good. I'm exactly where I should be. I look, if you fucked on a ghost bed, you'd know it. <laughs> Because you're not getting up after that. I don't think I've known. I don't think I have. No. Uh, you'd know because oh, you'd, okay. you'd have a nice <laughs> slumber after that. You'd not be going anywhere. You'd be sleeping on a ghost bed from ghostbed.com. Flash 25. 25% off. Next up, D'Anthony, who we got? I don't care. Yeah, you don't. <laughs> ExpressVPN.com yeah. forward slash drinking bros. <laughs> Protect your digital butthole. Um, that was not your butthole in this picture on the thumbnail. Um, that Damn was, it! Who who's was that? Um, in the ATM. Oh, the scene? gaped one. That was the, her friend. Oh, that was yeah. Bella Jane. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Lovely butthole, by the way. Yes, and and with expressvpn.com dot com forward slash drinking bros, you can protect your digital butthole. It is a seamless app that runs in the background of every device you have: mm. <laughs> iPhone, laptop, desktop, hardtop, 
Cell, <laughs> cell tower. Side top? Uh, mirrors? It's on, it's on vases. You can put it on a vase. No, it's, uh, it, it protects all your info. Nobody can steal your password, hack into your shit. Also, and this is crazy because you're on the shows. We talk about this all the time. Mm-hmm. At work, people have firewalls that they're, they're not allowed to watch porn. Yeah. This breaks the firewall. <sighs> Seven bucks a month. ExpressVPN.com forward slash drinking bros. You get three free months for free. That's smart. Uh, yeah, dude. It's 70 bucks a year. Fuck it. You'd be dumb not to have it at this point. Very dumb. If you want to watch her and, uh, you know. At, at work? At, at work. That's um, hot. Because, I mean, there's another one here. Dykes. Do you remember this one? Horny blonde teen comes with curious lesbian friend. Who's my curious lesbian friend? I haven't seen that one. Oh, yeah. yeah. I like her, too. Yeah. So uh, oh, no. you can watch this at work with expressvpn.com forward slash drinker bros. So let's say you're working at fucking Cisco. You know, you just have an office job. <laughs> Boom. Pop it up. You can have a quick jerk at, at lunch. Or if you're on the church Wi-Fi. Yeah. Church. Oh, my God. I have a lot of people actually who message me from work. Bored because they're in a meeting and they just like on my Sex Panther. Have you heard of Sex Panther? Yeah. Yeah. And so they're always like, please keep me company. And I'm like, let's come today at work. It's hot. Fuck yeah, it let's is. Do it. It's great. Yeah, I we can't it. hear you off camera. Uh, nope. <laughs> I agree, though. So the last one has to be used in the porn industry a lot. Our last sponsor. I Get Roman.com <laughs> forward slash drinking bros. Everybody's popping Romans, right? And in, in porns. Roman is uh, a company that's sells boner pills. Boner pills. Oh, They're the yeah, biggest on the planet. Right I'm now. not a man, so I don't know. But but on <laughs> set, do they say, hey, man, I'm homeboys chopping up some Romans, so we're no. going to go in 15 minutes? Honestly, there are a lot of men in this industry who like to keep it to themselves. I actually had someone the other day because they had to take their doctor's office call in front of me, mm. and they were talking about their Viagra or whatever, and they were like, did you even know I took pills? And I was like, no, I didn't. They keep it to themselves. Man, well, Some people shoot up their dick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Weinstein used to. It's crazy. Yeah. And that was him when he could get up. That's Scary. why he was jacking off in front of everybody because he had like two hours to Look, come. I put needles yeah. in my dick all the time, but it has nothing to do with erections. No, he just likes henna. Yeah. He's a big uh, henna fan. Every week henna I'll tattoo a new symbol. I on see. Ding dong, yeah. yeah. On your, on, does it hurt? On the top. Of, yeah, well, I mean, it doesn't feel great, but you know, it is what it is. But it, do you like that? Do I like pain in my dick? Not particularly, but it is what it is. Yeah. You like ball busting? To, uh, no, that's dumb. What's, what's ball busting? Rude. What's Paul It's my favorite shit where I get to punch the fuck out of your balls. Yeah, that's no not way. Or kick them. How hard? As hard as I want. Really? If I you, love I, it. If someone did that to me, I would strangle them to death. Can you? Whoa. <laughs> just like instinct. I would fucking. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, instinct's going to kick in at that point. But some people, honestly, that's the, the, per, the person's kink. I had someone who hired oh, yeah, no, me to do it for popular, them. Yeah. They like the pain yeah, yeah. in their stomach. That's yeah. pretty popular, yeah. yeah. Fuck that. Um, but, I had someone who let me like bite the fuck out of their dick. That was fun. A lot Whoa. of fun. Yeah. Um, I might allow that. I don't know. It, you you might. Allow that probably. You yes. want to try it? Maybe. It's the, ball, it it's the balls that fuck with me, though. Well, the I'll just give you pain to your dick. Dick's then. a dick. That's okay, fine. cool. Let's, uh, get, I like both. let's get a hammer. Uh, some. I have heels. Can we do heels? Too? Uh, no, I'm hammer guy. <laughs> yeah, Sorry. He's, he's all hammer. I'm so if you're going to do it, you take a fucking hammer. And to it's his, the backside of a claw. I like it. Yeah. I'll hammer you as hard as you want. <laughs> Goddamn right. Did I just get pegged? What happened here? In many, many God ways. Damn it. Uh, but if you're if you're gonna load up with a lady like this, you better go to getroman.com forward slash drinking bros. Uh, free doctor visit, free shipping comes in a discreet package. No one will know you have a boner. Uh, you don't have to go into your doctor and, even better uh, and acts about it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I would I I would assume. Again, that would have to be part of the job. Like, if I was a porn star, I would go straight to the Romans and be like, all right, great. I want to know what I'm getting. Well, what, what let's time. hear what the females do. What do you do to prepare for shit? I mean, you guys, we've heard from, from Jacqueline that she's big into uh, douching all of her holes first before she gets into it. But, I mean, staying wet for four hours while you're shooting different scenes has probably got to be a situation. You don't have to be wet you all the time. Stay hydrated, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> you don't have to be wet all the time. There's lube. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, my grandfather taught me that. He did. He did. Uh, Dan Can you to, calm down, please? Yeah. Sorry, Jesus. you guys are really funny. Katie, he <laughs> used to smell his grandfather's bicycle seat after a 10-mile ride in July, and that was one of his favorite hobbies as a child growing up. So you have a granddaddy fetish? 
Um, Ooh, that would be a great one, wouldn't it? Somebody's mm-hmm. got to have one. There oh, is. people I've, do. I've, I've had someone message me yeah. and ask me if I would get with an older man because he wanted me to do a grandpa Well, there's, there's this group of dudes. They're called the uh, Blue Pill Guys, BPG, I think. And it's three old dudes. Yep. They just cruise around. Now they're getting, like, it started out as, like, a, this weird little niche thing that was small. But now they're starting to bang actual, like, porn stars. Yeah. So it's getting weird. Not BPG. Weird. weird in a good way. <laughs> What's the oldest dude you fucked? Um, I believe he was like 50, 55 between there. That's not bad. Actually, lies. I just, when I did Brazzers, 60, 60, zero, six years. No yeah. shit. Yeah. Wait, he's 60 years 60? old? 60. What's oh, his shit. name? Kieran. I don't know who Kieran uh, is. Oh, shit. Never mind. He's Steve just Holmes? Steve Peter Holmes, his name? Any relation? Any relation? Do I have relation to no, him? No, to Johnny? Johnny John Holmes? Holmes? I don't, I don't think so. Okay. He's, I don't know. You know him? Because all the no. names are real. Right? Yeah, do you know the old school porn stars? No, I'm really bad with you names. You don't know your history. I don't even, knew, I don't even know new porn stars. <laughs> really? No, I'm You're just like, yo. I know the people I know, and that's pretty much. You're like, show me, show me a dick? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I might dick. know what your dick looks like, but I don't know what your face looks like. Yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> it's like a mugshot. Is that what you guys do? You guys get ID cards from the porn industry, and it's just a picture of your genitals, or what? <laughs> no one, I be, wish. Yeah. I wish. That'd no, be funny as shit. They don't even. I kind of wish that they would send us like mugshots of the guys' genitals before. Yeah, we, dude. We did like, that. what if you That'd got pulled nice. over by a cop? He's like, uh, license and registration. You're like, you know what? You give them the wrong one. Right, right, right. <laughs> Here it is right here. Here's my pussy. You probably know it. Enjoy that. You've probably, seen are, it. probably jacked yeah. off Jack, to me. Yeah, for yeah. Sure. And make sure it's like a cream pie pussy too. It's like, hey, here we go, brother. Yeah. And he looks at because that way he knows that uh, you're irresponsible. Yeah. <laughs> and that's the key. Because that's what we want out of all of our porn stars is to be irresponsible. Exactly. I want you to be living on the edge. I want you oh, to yeah. be irresponsible enough to let me come on you, but responsible enough to abort that piece of shit kid before it comes out. You know what I mean? Oh boy. Dan is out of control <laughs> today. No words. No <laughs> words. Holy shit. I'm just saying, you got to be flexible in life. Yeah, you do. You do. Uh, I, get a, I, get, I got one for you. You're up for Best Newcomer this weekend I at the am. AVN Awards. Fan nominees, yes, Best Newcomer. Fan nominees. Who are you yeah. up against? There's 40 other girls. Um, I'm against, actually, my closest friend who I've known since freshman year, Kenzie Madison. She's okay. also up for Best Newcomer. Um, I've known Brooklyn Gray since I got into the industry. She's also up. Alex Cole. Um, those are like the main people I pay attention to because obviously I've known them so long. Sure. <laughs> Have you prepared a speech? If I win? Mm-hmm. I've actually heard that they don't do the fan nominees on stage. So they just kind of give you the award afterwards. So I don't know how true that is. That's bullshit, man. Right? If it's from the fans, like, that's like, everybody that's jacking off to them. I feel like fan nominees are more important. Yeah. Yeah. Than the rigged fucking we decide who wins. You know what I mean? Would exactly. you give like what would your speech be? Would it be like talking about your like the people who helped you, or would you go like political and be like, look, we I'm need not to talk a political about- person, honestly. I, I'm not either, but mm-hmm. I would talk about climate change. Okay. But I would, <laughs> <laughs> but I would only... A, it's I would affecting only, vaginas. Yeah. I have <laughs> fucked so many times that this climate change is way too dry for my vagina, yeah. and I need you all to work on it, or else I can't do this anymore. Yeah, that would... See, there's, therein lies there the is. power of the pornography <laughs> It would be awesome if an Australian girl <laughs> won and got up on stage nude and lit her bush on fire. Yeah. And just said, this is what's happening. You guys, and too the soon. Under. Too no, soon. No, but she's no, telling not. you about climate change. She's like, look, it's, this is this is my land down under. Yeah, yeah. This is, Very and it's true. not too soon because it's still happening. I, yeah, that is so still a brush fire. Yeah. You know, <laughs> she bringing she would bring it to the media for sure. Uh, that'd be great. A fucking they let a, a kangaroo just dart across the stage, and then a koala, huh? Yeah. Damn, we can't hear you. You're not my. Listen, up. stop talking. Sandra. I think it's <laughs> smart to bring awareness to it. Yes, honestly, you guys are kind of smart. Yes. Yeah. No, but I was just kidding. Don't be dangerous do and light your bush on fire. That's a little crazy. No, <laughs> well, just, climate change is crazy. If you could like put it out easily, then I understand. But don't hurt yourself. And how would you do that again? <laughs> I slapped it like yeah, that would like, help, right? You just slapped your pussy. <laughs> um, I don't know that that's gonna put out a fire. <laughs> But okay, we can try it. Slap uh, it out. It's fine. I, when you were when you were coming up with your porn name, uh huh, was there any thought of a play on words with another celebrity? Because I know that's big. Not really. Actually, okay. the way I came up with my name is when I started webcamming. My name was already Kate, 
And um, so I decided to change it to Katie because it just sounds better. Sure. And then younger. It sounds like very childish, playful. Yeah. Yeah. Because that's what they like. Yeah. <laughs> and then um, when I came up with my last name, my old agent actually helped me out because they knew I loved to smoke weed. And they were like, if you do the, of course, if you name yourself a marijuana, you could get like people who want to sponsor you for marijuana chains. Oh, yeah. Free yeah, yeah. weed. Yeah. But then I was really thinking about it, and I was like, you know, Katie Kush just really flows off the tongue really well, so that's yeah. why I like yeah, it. Alliteration. Yeah, alliteration. Yeah, I like it. Everybody likes it. Yeah, I like it. If yeah. I was, if I was gonna, I think I'd just go I, like Greta Thunberg. Is that taken? I don't know. I've never uh, heard of it. Uh, <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I didn't think Katie Kush was taken, and so, then you fucking get in the industry, and people hate you because your name's too close to there. So. Yeah. Oh really? So serious. Is there cat fights over that shit? Of like, mm-hmm. hey, dude. Don't do that. Greta Thunberg, by the way, is that uh, like 13-year-old autistic girl that's been traveling the world talking about climate change. Yeah. That she's, girl? Yeah. I didn't know she was autistic. Yeah. 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 But that's, so am I. It's not a big deal. Yeah. It's not a big deal. I used to work with special needs and behavioral kids like, before really? I got in the industry. I worked at a school for behavior on So you did porn kids. with uh, How? autistic people? No. <laughs> no. That's not what I'm saying. Before that would I got, be a full circle moment, wouldn't <laughs> it? I, One of them grows up and you used to teach and then boom, yeah. they're banging. You're like sucking Yikes. his dick and he's doing math on a chalkboard or some shit. One of the He's like, I got into this because of you and now we're fucking. Yay. Yes. One of the well, biggest videos on <laughs> Pornhub <laughs> is uh, Mom Bangs Retard. Retard's son. Have you seen this? No. Dude, but it's not I'm like going to see it today. Five <laughs> as soon as this I will jerk over, off I'm... to this right after. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, I'm pounding off six, eight times a day now, so it's like you got to fucking get a little variety in there, otherwise. Yeah. You know. What number are you at so far right now? Today? 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 Yeah. yeah. Um, shit, hang on. I have no idea. I was like, four? <laughs> um, three. Okay. Been, I'm, I'm tired. We had a long night. That's all right. I didn't get home until like three last night. Yeah, we went hard. You last have night. a long enough time for three more. It's okay. Oh yeah, yeah. For sure. Yeah, I'm yeah. not gonna not hit my numbers. It's a quota <laughs> thing for me. I must hit my numbers yeah. every day. Is so, Dan your type of dude? Uh huh. <laughs> well, she said she's not into the whole dating thing. That probably means she doesn't really have a type. No, she's I just like kind of you know random shit. Fuck whoever I'm told to fuck. Whoever, but sure, whatever. So, 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 okay, we're English yeah. major over here. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm tired of all the the typos and porn titles. And it's, <laughs> like, I'm trying to help you guys out. You should teach us a lesson. I was your... I was watching I was watching this uh, <laughs> Apostrophe video. Apostrophe R E. Okay. Yeah. I'm watching this video and I'm pounding off, and all of a sudden the girl says "then" instead of "then," and I'm like, my dick just got soft. Yeah. Yeah. And I walked out of the room, and you know, alliteration porn. Yeah. It's a thing. That should be a thing. It's, it's, it's a be kink. A thing. It's a kink. I'm sure ever, there's a kink for fucking everything. Don't kink shame. It's rule 34, Dan. man. I'm not kink shaming, man. Your thing's your thing. It is. It's rule 34 of the internet. Yeah. yeah. From from uh, uh, 4chan. Yeah, so don't. They, they made these weird ass rules of the internet. Don't kink shame. One is don't talk about 4chan. The second one's don't talk about 4chan. They stole that. Obviously from, from Fight Club. Fight Club. <laughs> but the rest of them are just random bullshit. The number 34 on the list is. If you can think of it, there's porn of it. Yes. So you'll do something like, I need a Rule 34 check on Marge Simpson. And mm-hmm. somebody will find a video of Homer banging Marge. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And send it to you. Dead serious. There are people in this industry, like in uh, porn stars or whatever, that will think of something in their head like, oh, it's never been done before. And then look it up and they're like, damn, it's been done like before. There's a whole yeah. magazine yeah. dedicated to them. What's yeah. the most fucked up thing you've ever done? Um, probably Perf City when I ate a donut out of a man's ass and Pez dispensered animal cookies out of his foreskin. Whoa. The foreskin thing is just unnecessary, but... That is a lot to unpack Now, right how do now. you get a whole donut in some dude's ass? It wasn't in his ass. He, like, held it, it in like between his cheeks. Oh, I see. I okay. See. And then I just went in, like... <laughs> Nice. Vacuum good, sucked good, it out. Good for you. Uh, so... <laughs> <laughs> we had, uh, uh, what's your nuts? Um... <laughs> Tiana Trump uh-huh. told us that she would let a dude shit in her mouth for fifty thousand dollars. Yeah, it's like fifty k and shit in my mouth. You know, fifty k is a good price good starting point. Anybody shit in your mouth before? No, never had anyone On ask me to either. No, Cleveland steamer, nothing like that. The only thing with shit that I've had someone ask me to do is to record myself shitting for them. Oh, that's dope. Yeah, from good the time. from the oh, bottom. Oh, so dope. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did you do it? No, I will charge a lot for that, and they didn't want to pay. Really? Yeah. What, what's, so what's the going rate to, to watch you take a shit? I don't know other people's going rate, but my going rate would definitely be have to like 5,000, 10,000, you know? Five grand yeah. to, to watch because you take a Because that's definitely something like if someone wants you to record your, yourself shitting, <laughs> they probably want to steal it to post it. Yeah, yeah. So if ah, you're going to sure, steal yeah. it to post it, then I want my money's worth from yeah, it. Yeah. 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 You know what I do is I print out 
<laughs> Damn it. You can't uh, even finish your own no, sentence. No. Here's, what, here's what I would want, right? So let's say I'm paying five or ten grand for somebody to take a shit. Uh-huh. I want I want to plan out the meals the night before. Oh, yeah. You want to get the right consistency of, of, oh of shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't yeah. want some fucking, I don't want an apple milkshake because that's going to be jarring. You, you know you what an apple milkshake s- is, right? So No, but what would you want? For, so the first one's an apple and then it's just oh, milkshake all over the toilet. You know, so you have one hard piece, oh, so but then di- the okay. rest of it is diarrhea. Well, yes. Okay. <laughs> is, yes, yes. We're not about labels around so here. So here's what Sorry, I, I, I am. I'm I would want. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'd throw in an extra five grand and then because I want to watch you eat the night before. Nothing pornographic. All right. Um, I want to watch you have some Del Monte frozen burritos. Okay. Like uh, a mukbang type shit. Yeah. Or yeah, go to okay. uh, Taco Bell. They're not a sponsor. I wish they were. Um, <laughs> I ta- love Taco Bell too. Yeah, Taco <laughs> Bell's got a new family tray of nachos Bel Grande. I think it's like eleven ninety nine. I'm really hungry. I know. <laughs> yeah. So I would want to see about? that extra beans, and then like where you just can't take it anymore. Right? I know. I was gonna say I could finish maybe like two burritos, not even. I and be full. I'd go steaks because Ooh. I know that the poops are gonna be better. You know uh, what I mean? I want to see more s- I, like fiber and and high fat protein. That's what I want to see. I want to see her shocked by her own shit, where she's just like, "Oh man, I was not expecting any like of this." Where it lifts her up off the bowl, like, yeah, the yeah. Fucking, <laughs> like where your calves, like, oh, your calves flex, <laughs> and then your your barely like your toes are barely scraping. It's like a really hard. I'll have to call you floor. if I really want to shit like that yeah. in my life. We, I don't we know can make it happen. Well, because I want to see, we but I want to see the whole thing. True. I want to see the sprint from the couch, like the moment of realization of like, oh my God, this is going to happen. Mm. What if you're driving? No, I, I'm, let me, yeah, that's what I was going to say. I'd rather have you out like walking your dog What if or you're something? doing something and you're like, oh my God, I've got to fucking shit right now. Like, we know what Louis, do you do? Louis C.K. says that every for him, every shit is an emergency. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. And that's the way it should be. That's, yeah. that's the way God intended it. But I think... Is it? So here, here, I don't think so. <laughs> 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 I think for me, it, like, because I, I don't like discussing bathrooms, I don't want to see you take a shit in a Walmart. Um, no. Or certain states. I don't want to see you take a shit in New Mexico. I think I could only, if I had to record my shit, only do it in my own home. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And I w- I'd want to ring. And I didn't know this necessarily existed until I watched that Aaron Hernandez doc on Netflix that everybody's <laughs> watching. He had, did you watch it? Yeah. It's fucking crazy. Crazy. He had, why do you have all of those cameras inside your house? So after have I saw that, I was that? like, yo, I could watch you from your living room. Run into the bathroom, take a shit, and see the whole fucking thing. You know, it's weird about you bringing that up as I've actually had someone ask me if they could pay my rent to put up live cameras all throughout my house, and I would have one day off. So people would see me sleep. Yep. They wouldn't, they actually said that they wouldn't do the bathroom part, but they'd have someone watch me, some people watch me sleep, shower, living room, kitchen, basically big everywhere. Brother. Yeah, yeah. It's big brother. Yeah, the only, the exactly. only issue i would see with that is that uh if you were making money off of it then there's a legal requirement to have everyone has to sign, sign a paper coming release. into your house yeah, yeah. you have to sign yeah. a media release every yeah. time something that's a pain or they'd have to come in on your day off that and i'm just like considering i'm already in porn like you've seen me do a lot there's some things right. i should probably keep private you know or else you know my whole fucking life like, i want to see you like yeah. deep in your nose looking for one of those that's cleaners. one of the reasons i was like i don't know if I- <laughs> yeah <laughs> oh no all, cat like so we, serious i don't know if i could be on live television all the time yeah. because i'm way too embarrassed we all do weird shit yeah yeah i get sometimes dan will get high and shave his <laughs> trim his pubes with a steak knife from outback steakhouse nice i've like, stolen a, quite a few of them over the years <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah yeah look they're not got that a collection sharp. they're serrated so it's like you've got to really stretch the pubes out and then go back and forth like you're playing a violin almost. <laughs> My pubes are very long. I should try it. Are they really? Yeah. Because that's a thing. I've right? Very big it's pitch. coming back. Yeah, yeah. It is. Oh, yeah. I think it's awesome, by the Run way. Run a comb through those bad boys? Or I don't, yeah, I, I don't, but I could. I don't like a full bald eagle. Like, I don't want to see Telly Sabalas' head down there. <laughs> <laughs> so, no one ex- except for you. No, well, I know who it is. Do you uh, know who Telly Sabalas is? It's an old no. school reference. He's the, the baldest man I've ever yeah, seen he's in the my baldest life. man. He was in... Uh, Clean bald. The, Mr. The, Clean. The Dirty Dozen. Yeah. I'm not. Mm-mm. Either or. So, what are you? What are you going down there? Is are, are you in sixties? Are you kind of seventies down there? Um, Bush wise. Yeah, what decade is, you, your pussy is it? In? Woodstock. I don't know what decade my pussy's in, but it's like a. <laughs> you got a, you <laughs> well, have a Woodstock sure. pussy. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> you fucking pull down your panties. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking Hendrix, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> At Woodstock. I mean, is is shit getting lost down there? Or is it just like? Yeah. Can you no. find your car keys? 
You can find your shit. I mean, okay, so I keep my lips clean. The reason I don't like a full bald eagle is because I have very sensitive skin, which means, you know, like the pebbles, the bumps, yeah, the red marks. The time, yeah. Yeah. Right, so I didn't want to deal with it anymore. So I was like, why not just grow my hair? And it doesn't look weird. <laughs> you don't look like a fucking naked mole rat, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So Do you style just, it? I, yeah, I just style it with a razor. It's just a little triangle, and it, I let it grow. That's so, cool. I want somebody to start like making faces down there. Like yeah. shave a face and you know, if I was an artist, I'd do some cool shit. But I, you know, what would be a blast for me is if, if somebody shaved in Abraham Lincoln, the face of Abraham mm -hmm. Lincoln, into your bush, because I think that would be like, oh my gosh, she's very patriotic. That would be good for someone with burnett hair. Mine's kind of blondish. So we dye that. You do the dye Abraham it. Lincoln, okay. and then maybe you do a black guy. Yeah. And that way, it's kind of like, you know, like you're welcome. Iconic for, for being, just, freeing you. Yeah. That's well, no, it's because we're it's it's this is airs on President's <laughs> weekend, so it's like you know, yeah, he I mean, was our favorite president. Yeah, it's appropriate, free slaves. Yeah, he right. uh, Lincoln was a good dude. Yeah, great he was. guy, um, great guy, terrible uh, at movies, um, <laughs> but a uh, good guy in real life. Right, right. he wasn't very good at not getting. Did shot you know him yourself? Head. Me? Yeah. Um, you know, <laughs> ironically, it's it's funny you say that. <laughs> is I, it? I kind of do. <laughs> so he was in a book that I wrote. I put Abraham Lincoln in a book, and then he was in a movie I I did uh, called FDR American Badass. Mm -hmm. There's a scene where he gets high with FDR in the White House, and then he flies them all over the city of Washington D.C. <laughs> and they're smoking weed together. <laughs> um, so I'm a big Lincoln fan. Okay, I know a lot about him. Wait, was right. that uh, Kevin Sorbo? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lincoln, mm -hmm. Abraham Lincoln was Kevin Sorbo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best It's one of the, my, the funniest scenes of all time So Kevin Sorbo Do you know who he is He played Hercules back in the day On those old ass 90s shows And he's been at a, he's been at a Andromeda I Yeah Andromeda he's been a, But anyways yeah. I'm such uh, a face person He was dressed as Lincoln on the set And he would walk around And he Like tell black, black people Thank you No he said you're, you're welcome, welcome. <laughs> <laughs> They were like for what And he goes well I freed you and he was like, I'm, he's, I'm in character, and he's, uh -huh. he's laughing about it. And uh -huh. I was, and one of the PAs came up to me and was like, Ross, man, not cool. <laughs> I was like, uh, sorry no. about that. You're sorry like, I do not that. condone. No. <laughs> but uh, have you ever fucked anybody famous? No. Really? I wish I was that cool. And so nobody's, so nobody's DM'd you or, or said, hey, man, one, I see one you on the person, and I fucking bone? One person, and I've hung out with him, but I what, didn't want to fuck him. Was it President Why? Obama? Because that was I didn't President want Obama, to. Wasn't it? Wait, was it? No. Was it Daniel Day Lewis? No. I'm Forrest Whitaker. But it was a dude. It was a dude for sure. Um, Carrot Top. No. Uh, let's keep guessing. I don't yeah, think you guys it, are gonna it, guess. Was it C Top? No. So it wasn't C Top. Huh? I don't think you guys Chris are gonna Angel? guess. Was it a Vegas guy? No, yeah. it was an L.A. guy. Mm, L.A. Mm. guy. Uh, let's see. Uh, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's in L.A. now, right? Yeah, he's oh, in you're LA. right. You're right. He's on I met him on the side of the street. Was it the? Was it Superman? No. Which okay. Superman? Henry Cavill? The, Bra uh, no, Brandon Routh. I don't oh, think yeah. he's done he's any. Gay, isn't he? <laughs> no, I don't married. think he's done any major movies lately, so I don't think you'll really guess him. Ooh. Ooh. Tom Sizemore? Huh? He's been in something oh. recently. Sandlot? Oh. Was he in the Sandlot? No. Is it, was the, it dog the red haired kid? Is it Hercules? Hercules? The dog from starts Sandlot? with a K. Um, and the last name starts with a P. KP. KP, <laughs> you right? <laughs> Audience, yes. figure it out. Yeah, figure out the KP. What, what's your Instagram handle? Katie Kush XX two. Okay, so find who this dude is and tag him and her and post it on fucking KP Drinker Bros. Kurt, <laughs> Coral, Craigers, <laughs> no. no. <laughs> no. I just decided not to like do anything sexual because I don't want to be known as that person. Okay. What was like, the... yeah, I do porn, but I'm not going to fuck everybody. Right. You know? what, what if he said, yo, I'll throw you. Like, can anybody just come up to you in Vegas and say, hey, man, I'll throw you 10K. You want to fuck? No. Really? No. Is that how that works? That's called prostitution. Well, there's, I mean, we've <laughs> not talked about to, it. We've talked to quite a few. <laughs> not trying to get arrested. Yeah. Because we've had, we've had, there was a bunch of girls in Vegas who are, will come up and be like, hey. There are know. girls who will, and I'm not knocking the, the girls who do. There are ways around it as well. If you didn't want it to be prostitution. For sure, but it's just not my thing. I don't Got know you. if you're clean, and my body is how I make my money. So if you're not clean and I pop dirty within my two week test, then you just cost me money, and I so don't want to deal with that. When you say pop dirty, what uh, explain STDs. that to the audience? Oh, gotcha, gotcha. We take as porn stars, we take a test every two weeks by law. Yep. And if you pop dirty, you can't perform. So that means within the week of you getting healed and then retesting, that's no work. That's no money. I'm not trying to deal with any of that. 
Damn, dude, you're a gangster, son. I'm really all of it's. I hate not to sound like <laughs> greedy or whatever. Yeah, yeah, but you're <laughs> about all, the money. I'm seriously <laughs> all about my money, but that's only because I've been living on my own since 16. So, like, I've been, I have to support myself, you know. I doubt anybody's uh, cutting discounts and porn. People don't get into for the love of the game, right? Yeah. That's like, oh, you know what? It's really I mean, like, I do, I do me. love what I do. Yeah, I love course. that I get to have sex. I've learned a lot about myself but through porn. But if you porn, weren't making good money, you would not be doing correct. it. No one would. Yeah. Uh, I went to it because. With the nine to five that I was doing, I would definitely be fucking homeless. And the nine to five is when you were uh, hooking working up with in autistic the school. people. Yeah, I was not hooking up. But she said that before. I said I was working in a school. Oh, working in a school. <laughs> I was working okay. in a school with special needs and behavioral kids, um, and it just doesn't not fucking pay the bills. So no, of course I had not. To do something better. Man, well, congratulations yeah, on all you. your success. Is For it real. is it six figs? Like, what are we talking in porn? Yeah. No, and you can't even. A lot of people. F- um, think that you can make a living just off a of film. You got to do your own thing nowadays. Mm. Yeah, because look, Pornhub's monetized right now, yeah. and it seems from the outside, and you would know better than we would, obviously. Maybe that they're <laughs> making a, a decent amount of money. It uh, depends on how many views you get, but yeah, if you get the, if you have the views, then there you're making ch- good money. There's a chick named Lindsay Love um, that we were trying to get on the show. Her and her husband fuck on on porn. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she's a fan of uh, a company we work with, Black, Black Rifle. Rifle Coffee. So is one of our sponsors. So is Corey Chase, by the way. She's a huge fan of Black Rifle. Yeah. So and I mean, some of those videos are you know 11, 12 million views, mm-hmm. and I'm like, fuck, man, they've got to be killing it. I think someone told me for every millionth view you get, you make like six hundred to seven hundred dollars. Hmm. So YouTube is about two thousand. About two grand on YouTube for every yeah. million views. For every million, wow, mm-hmm. wow. that's even better than porn. Yeah, but you can't but obviously you can't post your butthole on porn on YouTube. On, on YouTube. You can't. I mean, no. if you dress it up like a reindeer or some shit, maybe like put a reindeer nose in there. Yeah, <gasps> like a face around I should, be, a, around I should it. be a makeup artist person who does like butt makeup. Yeah, buttholes. Yeah. Oh yeah. I should. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, you really should. Thank you. I'll start doing. <laughs> yeah, you should. There's a, no shit. We were talking about it on the show the other day. Uh, I think. But there's this. Actually, we we may not have talked about it. It's there's a, um, this woman who takes. She she got all these dick pics sent to her and her friend, mm-hmm. like on the internet. Obviously, like everybody else does. Mm-hmm. Uh, I get plenty. But anyways, uh, I'm sure not enough, but plenty. Uh, While coming, right? Yeah, and go to again, go to Dan Holloway on Instagram <laughs> yeah. and uh, DM him some dick pics. Yeah, I can't wait, guys. He loves them <laughs> all. Jackasses. The veiny are the better. Veiny are just meat, meaty. <laughs> want that shit I'm i want a, mine veinless i'm a, I'm a it's like uh if ron swanson was gay like yeah. all the meat keep the vegetables aside <laughs> yeah yeah no Any, potatoes anyways. let's just see the tube steak yeah. smothered in underwear anyways this woman <laughs> now so, so it inspired her to like dress dicks up yeah like famous people and take yeah. pictures of them she's selling them for like five ten thousand dollars a piece that's crazy these, these yeah, yeah, yeah so you could definitely do some stuff with buttholes yeah that's like the artist who put a banana on the wall with some duct tape and made thousands of dollars for that yeah shit. yeah yeah, fucking crazy. 150k for that painting, I think. Yeah, I got painting. I, it was a banana painting, but yeah, yeah. Yeah. on the wall with for duct tape. That piece of art. Yeah. I'm a big Sound of Music fan, so I got the Julie Andrews one, uh, where she's in the meadow, where um, she's peeing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So she's, she's at the top of a hill in the meadow, and she's just I've seen urinating down the hill. <laughs> You've like, never seen Sound of Music. I don't think I've seen Sound of Music, but I don't think I've seen that. No, yeah, it's because I just made it up. It's a no. It's in the director's cut. Oh, it's in the yeah. director's cut that you got re-released. Um, and she couldn't hold it, Rolf. and they had to shoot that scene, so they yeah. were like, look. And at the bottom of the hill, it's Rolf, the little Nazi kid. <laughs> Blonde hair, blue eyed, it's just a stream of urine hitting him inside the face. <laughs> but hey, you know what? Again, we don't kink shame here. People we don't no, kink shame. not at all. No. We don't kink shame. Are you into pee? What's that? Are you into pee? No. Like, I, no. <laughs> it's one of those things where it's like, you give it a go for someone. If if someone's into it, where you're yeah. like, eh. Look, back, back in the day, I was fucking crazy obviously so was everybody else i've never had anyone ask and really? I, I you've don't never think, done it i don't think i would care that much why would peeing on somebody matter to me if it mattered to them it? then i would do it like no. if some if some girl that i cared about wanted me to piss on her it would because who cares it's pee who cares right but would that you that take it me. if if a girl wanted to pee, pee on, on me, you yeah who cares in yes. your mouth it's just Mm, mm, mm. I have to think about that. That's where most girls want it to be is in your mouth. I think I it's mean, a dominance thing. I've, yeah. I've, uh, like take my piss in your mouth and fucking swallow it. It's a dumb thing. Mm. Yeah. Maybe. Right now. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, we've all swallowed a little pee over the years just from. Oh, yeah. Like if you're eating pussy and she starts squirting, that's urine. No. It's not urine? It no. Is. What is it? What's it's about the liquid? 73% Stop. urine. Break it down. What's it might liquid? be a little bit urine, but it's not all fucking urine. It's mostly urine. Okay. 
What, what, what is it? Who cares? Oh, do you squirt? I don't know this. I do squirt, but I squirt. Depend. It takes a specific person to make me squirt because you have to know where my spot is, and typically my spot is more up instead of down or to the sides. Yeah, I've, uh. I've had that happen before. A girl was like, actually, when we were fucking, she was using her thumb to push no. her fucking shit down. I like, like when a, people push on my stomach too because it makes my spot push yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This is yeah. what she was doing that. Yeah. I'm like, I can do that. Just yeah. stop trying to injure yourself. <laughs> you handle this. Yeah, listen, some guys don't know, so we got to do what we got to do. You know? I found out recently that I really enjoy <laughs> slapping the shit out of people. And In the I face? never thought, yes. Women. I don't like I, that. I never thought I would like it. And honestly- Somebody uh, told you to do it? Somebody asked me, and I like they, they didn't ask me. We just talked about it jokingly one day. And I'm like, you know what? Fuck this. I'm just gonna try it. <laughs> and I slapped the fucking shit out of her, and it was okay for me. It was mm-hmm. pretty hot, but she was like more into it than I. I than did you wind up? Uh, no, because I don't need to. You know what I mean? Like if so I wound up, I would knock her out. No, no, no. What'd you do? Um, I mean, you're not gonna I'm hear this at me. home. I'm just kidding. <laughs> for the people at home, this is what it was. What it was like. Ah, like that's okay. pretty hard. That's right? off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll take yeah. that on my to, ass, but not I don't need my to face. wind up. If I wound up, I would be in jail. Yeah, yeah. Because I would yeah. die. You'd and have like, knocked her out. I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think for sure. She would have been out cold. Yeah. And I don't. I don't have time for that. No, <laughs> nobody's got. Like, <laughs> I don't have time for the paperwork. It's just too much no. writing. No, <laughs> it's the it's the computer paper they printed out on though. It's a dumb matrix <laughs> printer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> she has no proof, though. So, like, yeah, it's true. M- me too, I guess. Uh, <laughs> what's the sickest sure. thing you're into? You like to choked, p- um, pissed I, on? I don't I'm know really that I'm really not a piss girl, which is uh, funny because people say that the first thing that you found sexually is normally your kink. The first thing I ever found sexually was a magazine of piss. People pissing in girls' mouths the whole night. It's not my thing. Mm. Um, first of all, it's not my thing because, like, even with cum, you don't know what that person ate. You don't know what that person drank. Mm. It may taste disgusting. Sure. So I'm you just want not a about nice it. Refreshing urine. Right. I need some not like a, water a... all day. You know, yeah. maybe then I try it. Yeah, you don't want somebody like dehydrated <laughs> yeah. who is partying at the Epcot Center all yeah. day. Yeah. Well, you're you're <laughs> basically describing the same conditions by which he wants to see you taking a shit, right? Basically. I want to control the input right. so I can enjoy the output. Exactly. So I want to control. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> I'm into hardcore like bondage, rope bondage. Really? Um, Jared's yeah. ex, Alex, uh, her name was Nikki Nine. She was a porn star back in the day. Mm-hmm. She's into that too. Like, but that to me, that is just way too much fucking work. There's no <laughs> goddamn work. I really is like, a lot of work. Yeah. I really like that people enjoy that because it's like good for them and whatever the fuck but for me it's just too much like, I, I understand can't. that not, Tying that, I'm, is a not lot. that i would be against it in principle like i don't have a problem with binding or being bound but that is a lot of goddamn it work. is yeah. i feel like okay if it's like in the bedroom and it's just me and a significant other type kinks then yeah, yeah. definitely just more hardcore slapping my ass like choking me i love being choked to the point where i'm about to like pass yeah, yeah, out yeah. Mm-hmm. okay i don't like being slapped in the face but if it's something like you're choking me out to where i'm about to pass up and you slap me to wake up I love it. But other than that, I don't like being So you've been face. slapped in the face. Yes. Hard. Yes. Okay. And yeah. you just don't. And what does it make you feel like when it happens that you don't like it? I'm just curious. Because I can't, I, I can't get a good explanation of why people do like it. It's um, like, you know what? It's, it's just hot. But that's not really a, a reason. I feel like the reason why I don't like it, I've, I've noticed even with doing bondage, I'm not a huge pain person. I'm more of like a rope tension person. Okay. So when they try to come at me with like canes, bamboo canes and shit, I hate that feeling. Yeah, like if you're... Uh, uh, if you spray paint spray it over graffiti. in Singapore. Yeah. yeah. In Singapore, yeah, you, yeah. you're going to get caned. Yeah. yeah I'm yeah, not about it. I don't like those like whipping pains. And I feel like slapping is a bit of more of a whipping pain. My face is more sensitive than my ass. I have more meat in my ass, you know? Sure. So it's like my ass kind of takes the blow. But with my face, it's all... Just very sensitive skin, and I don't like it. Yeah, I, it's also your money maker. You I, want yeah. bruises. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah, I think it's exactly. like an intimacy thing. Like, I had this discussion with the person afterwards, uh, not immediately. Like, I wasn't toweling her off and be like, "Hey, we'll unpack <laughs> yeah, 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 what yeah. just happened." Here. No, but it's like uh, kind of an intimacy thing. Like, I'm the only person in the world that can do this to you. Yeah, that's what it was like for it's me. The dom and submissive, part but it of wasn't it, yeah. dominating. It was more like. For me, it was like an intimate thing. Like, I know that she would not allow any other human being to do right. this. 
And also, I feel like when it comes to stuff like that, it's a very huge trust factor. Yes, exactly. So the, certain things that you allow to happen, you only allow to happen because you trust that person yeah, yeah. so much. So and that's what the swinger community talks about as well. Like I, I wouldn't really get down no. like that probably. And in, in a in a real like if I actually love someone, I don't think I would I would get down. Do like a swinger that. thing? Probably not. I've even heard a lot of the bondage people talk about it that even though it seems like the dom is the one in control, that's not really the case. No, no, no. Which You're it's not. The sub is yeah. the one. Yeah, yeah it's what sure, they yeah. want. It's. You just have to be able to listen to your sub. And if you can listen to your sub, you're probably going to be one of the best doms. I was actually just listening to um, someone talk about it the other day that as long as you can follow rules, like you're probably one of the best doms out there because it's not really about you. It's about the sub. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it's yeah. interesting. I, the weirdest thing is I like Subway sandwiches. Same. Um, <laughs> okay, Pete segue. Rose, by the way. <laughs> Pete <laughs> Rose is a big fan of Subway sandwiches. Jared <laughs> Fogel. Um, Jared, well, he's in jail. I do but not like of. Subway. Really? What's your favorite sandwich it's shop? It's so generic. It's terrible. Yeah. I'm not a big sandwich person. <laughs> Jersey Mike's person. is my jam. Jersey Mike's is great, yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I've had Jersey Mike's. Uh, weirdest thing sexually somebody asked me to do was um, right before I came choke their dog. I'm and sorry? Their choke their dog? dog. Yeah, it was, the dog was running around there. We're like, you got to choke my was dog. Was the dog pregnant? And no. Like normal, normal dog. <laughs> Normal dog. It was like a lab, what? and uh, you know, <laughs> and they were like, put it in a headlock, and then you can come all over me. And I was like, I couldn't catch the dog, um, like a chicken. Yeah, <laughs> well, you got. I was wet, and I was wearing a like uh, was... the top part of a clown suit at the time. And there Where was blood were you? all over my face. <laughs> Did she have a clown fetish? I, <laughs> no, he was just getting. I was a, working. He was getting Chuck off work. work. <laughs> <laughs> so she had a Chuck E. Cheese clown. Yeah, fetish. he was just getting off work. And, you know, honestly. <laughs> If you're going to do something with a dog or a cat, you got to get somebody to hold the legs. Everybody knows that. Yeah, yeah. I just couldn't get a hold of the dog. When I say do something, I mean Bestiality like, is not okay, okay? No, it's not. No, don't, don't have We don't promote that on the show. We never have. We do not condone. Never have. No. Definitely don't use a ghost bed for any form oh. of bestiality. Right, yeah. From ghostbed.com forward slash drinking bros. I mean, you know, unless you want to. Well. I don't really care what Not even do. if you want to. Ugh. Look, I mean, sometimes. You to just, your own discretion. You got to do what you got to do. I mean. Uh -huh. we, like, so, <laughs> and the reason why we bring this up, by the way, is we had somebody, uh, uh, somebody we knew, uh -huh. who that was their kink. Oh, no. They like to see their girlfriends and or wives get fucked by dogs. Oh. I know. And uh, mm. I wonder what that dollar amount would be for you. I want to know why. I don't know. Why is that your kink? What makes you want to see that? What about animals makes you want to see them having sex with humans? I don't well, get is it. Is there a dollar amount for you that for a dog? I could never. I love my dogs. Fucking never. And I want to see them. Never. I don't care. A billion Definitely dollars. Definitely not thousands. For a billion Hell dollars, no. would you fuck a dog? No. One billion, One billion dollars? Would I don't care. I would suck a dog's I don't dick care. and cup its balls nope. and let it come in my mouth for a billion dollars. <laughs> never. And you can I fucking couldn't. You can cut that clip out. Dear. You can. Oh. <laughs> hey, editor. <laughs> edit that shit out, please. No, no, no. When he says cut it out, we do clips on the internet for like, <laughs> yeah. this yeah, will cut, be one of the clips that, that we'll it use. <laughs> yeah, and post oh, okay. it. Oh, okay. So Instagram. for maybe like a thousand billion. I'm just kidding. No. That would be a trillion, I really by could the way. never. I really couldn't. Okay. For a billion dollars. You're I full really of shit. could not. I'm if so somebody serious. stacked up a billion dollars on a pallet over here and was like, and that's put yours. a dog in front of me, that I literally could not. I what would rather take the dog home and just be okay with the dog. It's my pet now. No, that dog showed up to fuck. So no, <laughs> that dog has no consent. It did not want to be there. You cannot record the dog and say you're doing everything on your own free will. You cannot. Sure you can. Yeah. <laughs> nope. You just get on all fours and see what happens. Roof, roof. Oh, <laughs> yeah. no. start, start making barking noises. Yeah. And, like, <laughs> I'm yep. just kidding. You put the bone right underneath. Um, your pussy. Don't fuck your pets. This folks. is yeah. dirty. Yeah. Please, Please never. Should really... Please never ever think of it. Peta already hates us. <laughs> oh, so here's so. what we're doing this year. Uh, we're gonna our buddy Street Bike Tommy's a member of Nitro Circus. Now he owns uh, a barbecue place, right? A really yeah. big one. So we're gonna take his barbecue food truck and park it right across the street from Peta headquarters in D.C. on National Vegan Day and have a big ass party and barbecue. Yeah. Nice. No, yeah, we are not. assholes. We're You're not. right because you know. Are you a vegan? You a meat eater? I'm not a vegan. I love meat. I could never go vegan. No, it's crazy, right? I fucking love meat. Steak yeah. is my favorite thing in the whole wide world. Same. Yeah, steak yeah. and whiskey. Yeah. I mean, steak. is there was there a guy in Vegas who'd fuck to go to Mastros? Like that's a great steak. 
I've never been there. It's the best. It's the best there is. Do I really got to fuck someone to go there, though? No, you can use money, I believe. They accept <laughs> American <laughs> currency But isn't there, it funner if, if you're mistaken. fucking someone and then they take you out for steak? Isn't it funner if you just get a free meal because it's like a date and then you're like, oh, shit, I got to go home. Sorry. Yeah, my, <laughs> I got to hold you just my get cat's a free meal? legs while this guy does whatever he's playing. Right, right. But for right. Mastro's, you got to at least give him an HJ. You got to throw you? an HJ his way. Can, How about you can touch my titty? And then... I don't think I could ever even come from just a hand job. Really? You don't think so? I don't I can't concentrate hard enough for that to be the case. Unless there's other stuff going on, maybe. But Okay, right, right. like what? Well uh, here's here's the deal. It's he like, likes the Thanksgiving parade from nineteen eighty five. He yeah, I, like I like the on repeat. Well, yeah. I, like the, I like the I like the floats, the parade floats, yeah. yeah. I mean it's, the floats get you hard. It's just the and well, the handy big, the really big things. Yeah, yeah. Like if I see a whale, I start pounding on it. You like really big, hard things. Yeah. Well, they don't have to be. They're actually soft and full of oh. helium. But if they were hard, that'd be cool too. I guess. Be I'm great. Not, I'm not gonna. What if they're throbbing? Gonna um. <laughs> <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I would be into that. We'll see. I don't know. <laughs> we'll I haven't see. seen oh, it yet, so we'll see. I haven't. I haven't. Look, Katie Kush, you've been a fucking blast. Dude. Thank you. You're really funny. Thank you guys uh, for having me. You're actually like super fucking cool and Thank rad. You. So, Thank you. Um, yeah, where we, can everybody follow Xander you on was social media? You, you were a huge piece of shit before the show, so we were like, "Oh, great, here we go." I've been told I'm an asshole, so I'm glad it worked out. Well, <laughs> we're all at, we're all assholes. Yeah, we're we're discussing humans. Okay, so now that you've been on the show. Awesome. Anyways, yeah, where Obviously. can people find I'm you on the interwebs? Glad we fit in. Everyone can follow me on Katie Kush XX, except Instagram is Katie Kush XX two. So okay. Twitter and Twitter, OnlyFans, many vids. Fucking what else is there? Snapchat. I don't know what else. Yeah, where are you selling vids at? I sell a lot of my videos on many vids. I sell literally all my content on OnlyFans. You can follow almost my every move on OnlyFans. Awesome. Yeah. And vote for you. Yeah, yeah, we're all over my Twitter. Um, It's on avn.com slash stars, I believe, under hottest newcomer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I do have a link to it on my Instagram and my Twitter. Awesome. Yes. Awesome. Thank you guys so much. Dude, yeah. you're rad. It was a pleasure. Uh, for Danthony, Danthony Holloway, Katie Kush, I'm Ross Patterson. We're the Drinking Bros. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night, Frank.